So this is an experimental video. Um, I'm going to try and probably keep it really short because um, I don't have time to set up a tripod or anything. But I need to cut some parts over here and I have a template for them, but uh, I don't want to route everything. I don't want to have to take the templates on and off and uh, use the sticky tape and all that because I'm, I'm trying to batch out a bunch of little pieces um, to make kind of a gift thing. So what I'm thinking of doing is if I can replace the... Um, the template function by using the track saw behind me on the MFT table. You can see the track has popped up. So what I'm going to do is document how I'm setting this up to produce a lot of small pieces. And the trick is I'm trying to see if I can make the table grippy enough to grab the small pieces that don't uh, contact the black foam on the rails that you see in the background. So uh, hopefully this works. So here's my trusty MFT table set up with the uh, the lift and so the really the only trick is I'm using this tool drawer liner um, that I've set up with uh, some blue tape and I have clamped down um, an, uh, like a half inch MDF board I think it's a decent sized board cover the table and uh, it stretches beyond the uh, the rail so this is my cut line right here and so it stretches beyond to support the pieces. And so I'm gonna set this up, I'm gonna run the saw, and I'm gonna see how it goes. Just to show you how fast the system is, I'm going to cut both sides in real time here. That's the slow side, getting that curve run in is tricky so here's the flip it's easier to line this up because the bottom's square got my line Just like that, I got my long lines. Quiet, no moving. All right, I'm using the same setup to do a little cross cutting to clean up the edges on the bottom. Set up the base, the feet. Sounds like the security system is working. And just like that.